This episode of Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater is brought to you by Feature Points, Get Free Gift Cards, Games, and much more. Try free apps, get rewards. Go to your iOS or Android browsers and type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash F E A T U dot R E forward slash V G O. Use the app, start reaping the rewards. Hey gamers, welcome back to my uh, gaming channel, Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater. I'm your host, Amit Geek. We're, we're back in the saddle again with Ben Jordan, Paranormal Investigator, case number six, Scourge of the Sea People. We've been um, traveling with our fishermen on a, on a boat. Uh, we've already talked to the Oracle, and we have a mission to go to the Minotaur Island on this vanishing island. Let's continue on our adventure. Minotaur Island. Here we are. Dinghy. It's the trusty inflatable dinghy you use to get here from the boat. Off the, the on the horizon you see your boat. Where am I? The Minotaur by okay, there's the beach. Let's head on toward our labyrinth. Okay, so according to the uh, according to the walkthrough that I read, I have to go the left path. Here we go. <coughs> so what's this? Boulder. A large boulder is leaning against the rock wall. It looks like it was moved recently. Maybe it was covering the opening. There is a normal narrow opening in the rock wall. Okay. You take a deep breath and prepare to squeeze through the narrow cave opening. Uh, fortunately, the opening is still too narrow. To for you to fit through. Maybe you shouldn't have had that donut for breakfast. All right. Let's um, use the suntan lotion on ourselves. It's a bottle of SPF 70 suntan lotion. Must be Simon's. So let's use some of that. Squirt it on yourself, on Ben Jordan. You apply a little bit of suntan lotion, take that melanoma, and on the uh, Let's do it on the opening. You smear the edges of the cave opening with of the cave opening with the suntan lotion. This will either let you slip in the cave or it'll just get you all full of lotion. Minotaur Island. Get in that opening. You take a deep breath and prepare to squeeze through the narrow cave opening. S you slip easily through the opening, except you're now you're all covered in suntan lotion. Yuck. All greasy. Oh, what's this? Save progress. On the wall, you see an ancient fresco depicting a frightening looking minotaur. This fresco depicts a male with a sword. Perhaps it's supposed to be Theseus? Maybe it is. Box. A medium sized and very old looking box lies opened on the ground. Next to it is a small broken lock. Let's get it. What's in there? You decide to examine the open box. You don't find anything inside. What? Whatever the box contained is long gone. However, you notice a strange tingling feeling in your feeling fingers when you get them close to the inside of the box. Alright, what's supposed to be in there? A 
strange tingling feeling. Someone has dug a hole in the cave floor, presumably to unearth the box. I wonder what could, what could happen there. Ah, I forgot to get the flower. I have to go back outside. You take a deep breath and prepare to squeeze through the opening. Okay, there's the yellow flowers. There is a small bush nestled in the rocks and on, on which are growing some yellow flowers. Unable to resist the bright yellow flowers, you pick one and shove it in your pocket. All right, excellent. Now we got that part. Let's get back to the cave. Yes, we're going in. So we got the yellow flower, we got the suntan lotion, we got the edge of the cave. Enter, open box, go back outside. Whoa, 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 whoa. Something I missed. Something in that fresco. On the wall, you see an ancient fresco depicting frightening looking Minotaur, but there's something sparkling there. Glint. It might be your imagination, but you think you just saw a small glint coming from the fresco. Come on. There. Don't want to ruin the fresco and risk making the archaeologist mad at you. Ah. Want to get that glint. Ah, got the glint. Aha! So it wasn't just your imagination. There was a small key attached to the fresco, made to look like the ring in the Minotaur's nose. You take the key into your possession. We did it, folks. We got the key. Excellent. Save progress. Look at the key. You got the small brass key from a Man Minotaur fresco in a cave. One hell of a souvenir, isn't it? Flower. It's a pretty flower. You have no idea what kind it is, though. Flower feels soft and delicate. The key feels very old, but sturdy. Save progress. All right, let's go. We're going outside. All right, now we, I think we have to go. Um, I think we have to go right now. All right, go direct right the right path. We went the left path already. Now we're going the right path. New experience. Wall. It's a wall. Build a wall small wall has been built here that means this island was inhabited by some at some point and some time part of you wonders if it still is all right what's this doors a, l it's a large set of wooden doors they have been secured with a padlock facade a large decorative archway complete with two columns have been carved into the side of the rock There are trees out here. I can't go in there. 
Let's open these doors. You pull on the doors. The padlock rattles, but that's about all that happens. All right, let's find our key. Your hands trembling with excitement, you stick the brass key into the padlock. It fits! You turn the key and open the heavy wooden doors. We did it, folks. We are progressing on Minotaur Island. We've opened the locked doors of the labyrinth. Here we go.